Hey my lovelies, welcome back to the channel. This episode is so full of exciting things and an almost catastrophe. I'm in Las Vegas. It is 10.30 on a night at the airport picking up my co-driver for King of the Hammers 2024, who you are gonna meet tomorrow. No, it is not Matty. Matty has taken on the role of Pit Chief, so he is running the show. I couldn't be happier or feel luckier than I do right now because that man knows every square foot of Johnson Valley and he's been doing this since the first time he cried as a child. So buckle up because there's a lot going on in this episode but for now I'm gonna go. We'll see you guys in the morning. And it's the next morning we're back in the shop. We're gonna show you what was almost a complete catastrophe. And you think I'm being dramatic. I'm really not being dramatic at all, right Manny? Total melodramatic. Just kidding. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so our upper link cross member was ripping off and the cross member had broke in half. Wow. So we've re-welded it, put a gusset in here, then we'll gusset some off the sides here. That could have gone very wrong yeah. if your BDI had not seen that. Yeah, it would have been fun out in the desert. But still, I'm glad that we caught that here and not out there. Yep. All right, so... What's left to do in here? Nothing. Put, come Put down. tires back on. We got what? You got axles resealed. Yeah. Okay, so Maddie just mentioned that I was working on the rear axle here. This is what I have on here. If you're wondering what these are, it is from Stage 8 Locking Fasteners. And it just makes sure that none of these bolts come out. Because believe it or not, I've done that in Kentucky. Oh, that's an axle. Oh my god, your axle shaft completely left the chassis. <laughs> But this will not move at all. So redid all of that, went into the front of the hubs, made sure that that locking nut was torqued down and um, feeling good about it. We're looking good. We're feeling good. So we're gonna take him down, put the wheels and tires back on and get Nessie back up. And I'll tell you exactly what's been going on there and what we're doing. All right, Simpy, what is going on today? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna continue like we did with these, these panels Ooh, here. Ooh, yes. So we didn't show them the finished product. Look at that. That's so very impressive. <laughs> so we're gonna transfer my little cardboard cutout here. Yep. We're gonna put it here. Yep. And we're gonna make it out of aluminum and then we will bolt your number right to that. So it's tucked away, but still visible. Amazing. Thanks, Simpy. You're the best. Boom. Oh. is back on the lift and this is what we're gonna do we're gonna play around with the shocks for a little bit because we didn't get to do that last year we're gonna put some more nitrogen in them and we're gonna see how that feels if it rides a little better which I'm pretty sure that it will update we are no longer going to Johnson Valley over the new year there's no need to anymore because we actually have a shock tuning appointment that's really hard to say for me when we head out for king of the hammers but we're gonna stay here and we're gonna get some seat time in here along with my co-driver who i'm gonna introduce to you right now Woo! 
Hello guys, uh, Yola Freeman here. Uh, I have been doing off-roading for about 12 years now. Got my first Jeep, Miss Tina, and that was kind of the snowball effect to the off-road world. Uh, started doing my first sponsored off-road rally about eight years ago, and that really started the career of doing off-road racing and kind of getting involved with off-road competitions for a few years doing a lot of co-driving now with uh, Ultra 4 Series and Nora 1000 down in Baja, uh, doing the Mint 400 earlier this year, and now teaming up with Holly to do KOH. Super excited about it. I think that we're gonna have a great time. And she's kind of asked me some questions about like, what, what am I worried about? Which is kind of a funny question, because I've thought about that and I'm like, anything to be worried about. I think we're going to do awesome and I think it's going to be great. I think our, our main goal is to cross that finish line and keep the rig together, right? Everybody wants Nessies to succeed and I think that we have a good chance at doing that. I'm excited about it. <laughs> All right, so the cat is finally out of the bag. YOLO and I are going to be hitting King of the Hammers 2024 in like four and a half weeks. I'm excited. I'm excited. Super excited. So she flew from Iowa. She's here for the week. We're supposed to be pre-running in Nessie right now, but we've been waiting for some fittings and we need Nessie to shift before we take her out. Otherwise, there is a chance of a complete catastrophe and blowing things up. So we definitely don't want to do that. But we've been in the car. We've been on the street up and down a little bit. We've done the calm thing. Um, there's a couple of things to work out there, yep. but it's going to be awesome and I'm so excited to finally be talking about everything. Yes. <laughs> so we are out here, as I said before, just to kind of pre-run a little bit, get kind of a little more familiar with one another. Um, even in Mischief Maker, it's perfect. So yeah, and Yolo's never been here. So it's, it's like a perfect time oh, as well. Fun. Perfect weather, mm -hmm. perfect company. Perfect rig to come out here and tool around. Yeah. Yeah. Good seat time. Good seat time. And that's what it's all about. So I think we uh, better head back to the shop, get some work done on Nessie and learn a little bit more about the rig. Anyway, we're going to hop on and head on out. And we're back in the shop. Maddie's been ready to do this all day. Bless his soul. I'm so Trying. sorry. It's all we've, right. been, we've been out doing things. But now we've got this going on. Power steering cooler, bigger one with fans. Ooh. That um, we are gonna install. Yep. Right down in here. Perfect. So we need to build mounts and weld everything up. And that's it. Better and then, better and then plumb it. There we go. So that's the project. Brackets in, get it in there, plumb it, get it running.
How are you feeling about everything, Maddie? Good? Happy. Happy? Yeah. We're going to have this thing up and running? We'll have it up and running. Yeah. Okay, we have that cooler in. It looks really good. We have the mounts. We've capped them off right here. And yeah, perfect. Now, what used to be in this place is the siren. We have moved this to down in here. It sits perfectly there. So all in all, a successful day. Now you guys know who the co-driver is. We have some work to get done here. It is the new year, so guys, hope you have a safe and wonderful, happy new year, and we will see you in 2024. Thanks for watching.